Hello everybody, welcome to JF TV. I'm J Lab and this is Football Manager 2016 the Swax Focusing Challenge. And we're in seventh place right now, four points of a Champions League spot, but I'm not really expecting to get in the Champions League this season, I must confess. I'll be very happy to get in the top half of the table this year and potentially win the FA Cup, but yeah, I'm not sure what's gonna happen. But we've won the last two matches. Leicester have just lost to Watford in their last match. And we are still above them and Newcastle. So if we win today, we have a four-point lead over Leicester. And we'll have a four-point lead over Newcastle until they play their game. There's a throw. Patrick. Jogamaya. Anyama. He played the cross. Hasn't he played the Patrick instead? He's played that to Jogamaya. There's pa pa Patrick again. Jogamaya. Anyama. Lassi. Wanyama, good pass it to Patrick. He has done, and Patrick's opened the scoring for us, and we have the lead. Maya, Bellotti. What's the point in there here? Is Bellotti injured? I think Bellotti's injured here. And they've equalised. Okay, Shrup has got the equaliser. Not what I wanted. Take on Maya with the throw. Pella. What are you doing with that? It was never going to go through. Diamantes. Oh my gosh, Shrub could get it. No. What the hell? They scored anyway, but. Oh my god, we're just not doing well against Leicester. We always seem to lose against Leicester. I don't know why. And as soon as I took off Ryan Yama, we started doing poorly. I don't know what it is, but we need to do better than that next time. Here's the third round draw of the FA Cup. And we've been given Watford, so that could be difficult if they are able to play as well as they are potentially able to. So Derby are bottom of the table right now and I'm very confident we can beat them. And if we don't beat them, I'll be very disappointed in the side. That's what I can really say at this point, especially since we're actually at home as well. Got a free kick already, he's burst with it. And Bolo's hit the post and Van Dijk is putting it in the back of the net. That is his first ever goal for us. And it's a very good start, less than a minute in. Thiago Maia, Pavon, what brilliant is it? But his Ince, but he's lost it to Patrick. Is in Berlin now back to Patrick again. We are dominating this game. And Pavon's made it 2-0. And this is looking so, so easy for us right now. Nine minutes in, it's already 2-0. And Berlo to Vinyama. This could be very, very one-sided, this game. Classy. Bertrand. Pavon and Bolo has made it free. It is going to be one of the most one-sided matches I've ever had. It's okay, Shuson's got the throw. Being cleared away, his Ince. And Johnson scores, so they actually have got a goal, which is rather frustrating. Maya, Embolo, Thiago Maya, Classy, Embolo. Classy's gone for goal, and he's made it four. We have a four-one lead. Oh, I wish it was four-nil, not four-one. But four-one win against Derby, we deserve this victory quite easily. So Manchester City, I'm not going to enjoy this at all. I'm no going to be absolutely slaughtered here. But we're going to have to try our best anyway. Because that's what we do for the fans. Camacho, Gundaga, Gaia, Camacho, Stagner. He's hit the post and Aguero scores. I don't know how he managed to get through, but they've scored. Not good. Kevin De Bruyne. Sagner. That's 2-0. Berahino has scored now. I never thought we'd say that for Man City either, the answer to. Silva. Torre. De Bruyne. Oh, Santon, what have you done? This is a horrible game for you today. Just not going our way, is it? They've got free kick. Pavel's hit it away. Here's De Bruyne. Pav, Bertrand, Santon. Clichy's now on the ball. And that's it. And Newcastle, the other game I'm confident we can actually win. And at this point, I'm thinking even we can win against Everton. Because they've been turned so bad. But Newcastle have only taken one point in the last five matches. And I'm confident we can add to their misery. Hopefully we can anyway. So we've got a corner. Pavon takes it. Dramat clears it. Here's Pavon again. Plays it in again. And Fonte scores the opening goal of the game. We are doing ourselves justice. Despite not winning by his big score, and we are still winning. And that's... The most important thing, as far as I'm concerned. Here's Rodriguez, Anyama, Santon. Uh, the best pass, but we've still got the win, and that's important. We keep our momentum going at home. 
So, we have Arsenal, then Chelsea, and we're going to lose both of them, no doubt, because we're not that good enough to really get the results against them. Especially away from home. We're terrible away from home this season, really are. I mean, the only away game we've really won in the league uh, West Ham and Hull. They're the only two away games we've won this season. Okay, because all has got corner in. And that is a goal from Sanchez. I wasn't sure if that's an own goal, to be honest with you. There's Bella in. Hi, Bella. Ramsey's got time and space to shoot, and he scores. It's over. We're not getting a result out of this game now. It's Bellerin. Still going. He's got speed on his side, let's be honest. It's offside. No, it's not. It's just game over. So we'll beat some 3-0, all of them come in the first half, and we just weren't good enough, really. Yeah, um, Chelsea probably expected to win. Look at the top five, and you only see one point between all five of them. That is how tight it is this season, and this is why I'm not very confident of getting anything out of this game. Costa, Hazard, and again, we're getting the ball back, but then we're losing it silly, stupidly. Here's in Berlin now. Hazard's uh, also got the ball back, and passing all round has been rather disappointing. But here's Williams with the ball for Bertrand, and that's what we wanted, and that's a goal for Diego Costa. Ryan Bertrand makes a mistake. Gets tackled and his full side scores. Free kick, Davis takes it. Van Dyke! Oh, he's offside! God, no! Offside! Okay, they got another throw. We've headed it away. Why is his name in capitals? Who was that? It's the last game of the month when we got Everton, so hopefully we can get this win and ensure that we don't end up on the wrong end of the a defeat and get closer to the top seven which has really seen Leicester shock a lot of people by being above Man City. Though admittedly they're doing this in real life, so perhaps it's not so unrealistic. Anyama is on the ball now, has Classy. Rodriguez finds Mbolo. He's turned back of the net. 1-0. Here's fifth of the season. And he's now a top goal scorer. Oh, Rodriguez not got to his Wanyama though. Classy. At right to Mbolo. Lovely ball in, Rodriguez scores his first goal of the season. And that's a good time to get it to. Makes it 2-0. So we've managed to beat a weakened Everton side, which is rather surprising. Not, no, that's not surprising what we're talking about. I'm guessing what's rather surprising to me is the fact that Everton are struggling right now. And I would expect them to do a lot better than this, but there you go. They're just not really up to the challenge right now. They're struggling big time. So, I'm going to end this video here. And Berlo managed to win the European Golden Boy Award, which is very, very good. I'm very happy we've got such a great tenant at the club now. I didn't realise this before, but his idol is a bit of a surprise to me. Not putting it to you, but his idol is Mario Balotelli. So, obviously he's doing something right here, but I'm very happy we've got such a good talent at our club. And he's now worth £20 million at the age of just 19. So, I've seen him being bought for £55 million on my other save. So, I'm not sure what's going to happen there. I'm hoping I can keep him long term. If not, then I I haven't. So, yeah. But anyway, I hope that you have enjoyed this video. I hope you like and favourite this video. It really helped me out a lot. I hope you like and favourite this video. I hope you subscribe to my channel. It really helped me a lot. And we are currently in 8th place, a place away from potentially getting the Europe, but I think the FA Cup is a realistic target at the moment. I really do. But, anyway, until next time, goodbye and well, good night.